This PowerPoint deals with spider vein complexes that are grouped. We use a combination of tumescent and foam scar therapy. You've seen this before. This actually is a PowerPoint where we do the technique a little bit different. Uh, it's an excellent technique to use, and you can see that it takes about five minutes to do it, and you can get excellent results. This spider complex is part of the lateral reticular system. These spider veins are grouped inferiorly. There is a small dermal perforator, which we will show in uh, the next uh, few slides, that actually causes this. This procedure took us about five minutes to do. You can get superior results when you use the demonstrated techniques as uh, demonstrated in this PowerPoint. So you can see a reticular vein here coming in. You can see a little communication between this large complex. So first we want to inject here to see if we can fill this up. First thing we do is we'll show you, we're going to put tumescent under here though, and then inject a very dilute foam 0.1 into this reticular try to fill up all this from this one communication. Here's the communication. There's the dermal perforator right here. Okay. First we're doing a subdermal tumescent. This just shrinks up the vessel by about at least a half. These spider veins will stick. So you get better contact with the vessel wall when you do the sclerotherapy. Now, you're going to see us in a minute. We're going to actually do the injection in about uh, two to three minutes right here. Now we're going to inject the foam. You can see it going down. Communication is small here, so we want to try to get in. If we can't get in this complex this way, we're going to actually inject foam with the 30 gauge needle right here. So that may be what we have to do. Okay? Now you can see this has decreased in size. We couldn't get the foam to come this way. So we're just going to do, we got the angle, the needle bent about 35, 40 degrees. Take a little, go right into the complex. You can see it's filling up the complex with the point one. Excellent result. So that's what it should look like for about five minutes. It'll start to slowly refill, but much slower with the uh, tumescent. Now we're just going to do the rest of these, and it will come back. If this clots up, we'll flush it. Now you can see now this is starting to clot up, it's kind of grayish. We're going to make a little tiny punch right where this perforator comes in. Probably comes in right here. We'll stick. After we make the small one millimeter punch, we're just going to flush out this complex. You can see it flushing right through there. And we'll look at it in about uh, three or four minutes and see if we need to flush it. This is about five minutes post-treatment. You can see this is an excellent result. Uh, after we've uh, done the tumescent, the uh, foam scar therapy, and the flushing technique, uh, this is what it should look like. Now, if you see still some retained clot in there, you can make a little neck with an 11 blade. And the vein that's clotted, there may be two or three little veins that are clotted. You can actually make a small neck with a lemon blade and then reflush the complex. Uh, this really gives you a good result if you just keep flushing it and get out everything you can. And then as you see in a minute, we're going to apply pressure on it. And, and um, this allows the uh, refilling to be somewhat compromised. You can't refill as well when you have a good compression. And then we do this with the pool noodle. Now this is a pool noodle wrapped in um, cast padding. We just put it right on the treated area. See how much better it looks. 
just like this, and we're going to use what we call a HepaFlex. HepaFlex is just a tape, and right here we're going to leave it on for two days. It applies tight compression. You can see it doesn't refill when it's tight. Now we're putting the HepaFlex on. We'll put another one on. We want it really tight. She leaves this on for two days because this really applies a lot of compression to where we did the major, major uh, therapy to the vein.